In today's video, we're gonna review Air France seven hour flight from Boston to Paris and also show you what you can do in Paris if you have a long layover. Stick around, I'll show you right after this. I just spent five days in Portugal, three days in Spain, and two days in France. As soon as I got to the Eiffel Tower, my phone died. Now we have made it to Le Louvre. The Europe tour starts now. Let's do this. All right, yeah. Uber for winter. Yep, Terminal E. Air Francis. At the airport. Now that we've taken off, let's talk about the plane. This wide body from Air France A350-900 can accommodate from 300 to 350 passengers in a standard three-class configuration and can fly non-stop on ultra-long range route for up to 97 nautical miles. This one has a one-to-one -one configuration in business class, 242 in premium, and 333 in economy. I was on seat 25A economy, where there was a blanket, headphone, and pillow for the journey. Soon after takeoff, the crew handed out a travel safe kit which included fresh face mask, disinfectant wipes, and hand sanitizer. Plus, later on, they gave us a refreshing towel, which was refreshing. We've been in here for about an hour now, which means it's time for dinner. I went with the vegetable pasta, which was served with a small salad, a cold bread roll with butter, a piece of cake with cheese, and a water. The food was nothing but tasty and high quality. Oh, I also got myself some champagne. So, cheers. Wi-Fi was available for purchase if you needed full speed internet, but WhatsApp was free to Air France Connect and Facebook Messenger. So that's what I use. Plus, IFE had some great selection for TV shows and movies. After a quick two hour nap, I went to the back of the plane to use the bathroom and to my surprise, there was a self-service snack available. Wow, bravo Air France. An hour and a half before landing, the crew handed out a breakfast bag, which included bread, cream cheese, strawberry jam, and orange juice. It's not just that, but the presentation is something to remember. Unfortunately, this great experience had to come to an end. But on the other hand, let me take you to the street of Paris to show you what you can do on a layover. So, welcome to Paris. So I left my bag because it was sort of heavy. And now I'm headed to center of Paris. Let's go. Okay. Now we are at uh, Gare du Nord. We're heading out.
I put down the GoPro. Now we have made it to Le Louvre. The Louvre. We don't need the past on our lives for tomorrow. Never see the end of the night, but we're sorrow. What do we do to love? What do we do to love? There it is, man. What do we do to love? When everything's said and done. What do we see à Paris? On va voir si parler français, hein? Guess where I'm at? The most visited museum in the whole world. Check out the line. There's no way. All right. On to the next one. Stairs. City of Stairs. Crazy. As soon as I got here, my phone died. But yeah, can you see it? I'm looking for a better angle. I was about to take some good photos, but guess what? Phone died. My power bank's in my bag. I left my bag at the airport. But hey, here's a better view. As soon as I got to the Eiffel Tower, my phone died. Still can't believe it. So now I have to get to the airport because uh, I have a flight to Portugal. What do we do to love when everything's said and done? What do we do to love? I've been walking all day, my face is greasy, I know that. So here's the bag I just picked up. And um, if I didn't put it on storage, I would have regretted it for my whole life, for my entire life. Like you've seen it, so many stairs. Imagine I had a bag. So now, we're back at the airport, going back to my gate, so we could head to Portugal. This transatlantic flight with Air France was a five-star experience. Fantastic crew, high quality food and service, and also plenty of food as well. You won't stay hungry. I don't know what else to say except for Chapoya France. And yes, if you have a layover for more than five hours, go out and explore Paris. Of course, you can see more than I did, but I wanted to see everything at a slow pace and enjoy the moment for as long as I could. Like I said in the beginning, Europe tour starts now. This is the first video from Paris. I will also take you to Madrid, Spain, where I spent three days, and also to Lisbon, Portugal, where I spent five days. So do not miss out on those videos. Subscribe, leave a like if you like this video, and au revoir from Paris.